Hi friends, this is Andy Vegan. Today is my juice fasting day. Once a week, I only have juices, maybe some nut milks, like it as a dessert at night or so. Uh, yeah, it's wonderful to have only juices. It's, um, it's so light. I have almost no work in the kitchen. Juicing, if you have a good juicer, it's a minutes thing. Yeah, I prepare my here in this case I have a pineapple, some red beets, I want to try a new combo. I tried already with the with the orange, yeah, pineapple and beet. That was a nice juice. A couple of years ago I did that. Today I but just put ginger. Because orange would be very own flavor, adding to the two ones, to the two here. Now I want to focus more on beet, as I find more and more beet is so interesting. As this earth flavor here, it's also earth flavor, kind of earth flavor with fire. Yeah. I add some fire to this combination that makes it nicer, even highlighting this combo. Ginger is such a highlighter; it's very healthy too. Gives fire to to everything, anti-inflammatory. Such a wonderful spice uh, can be used with many other components to highlight a special combination like this. Lemon is similar, and also. Lemons go, goes very nicely with ginger. Could use lemon here too, uh, but I have also a citrus here, that is the, the, um, the pineapple. So my, uh, um, I thought maybe better ginger, yeah. And um, well, beets are very interesting because I, guess, because I think they are very earth, earthy or earthen. And uh, uh, when we uh, look at the, the Asian, our philosophies, the old ones, the ancient philosophies, are pre-critical, as you would say, in the Western times, um, in the Western culture. So um, they uh, they have the uh, the cosmology uh, building up uh, the whole uh, universe from elements, from the different elements. The earth is used to be the last element, and other all the other elements are uh, uh, contained in the earth. So that makes me think of um, uh, the reason why there are so many flavors uh, within the beet. When you combine with other fruit, it turns into some flavors I never tasted before. Really amazing. Beet, more than any other ingredient almost I can think of. Beet is very special in there. It turns out to be my more, my more and more of my favorite ones. So this new combination, just pineapple and beet, a little ginger. I will try that now. It's also something I do on the fasting, especially because I feel more sensitive. I feel more, you know, uh, have more fantasy and more creativity because of the body parts, the firm parts, the earth parts, not the earth parts, maybe the more the, the parts where I need energy to digest. This um, um, energy uh, is all now for my creativity, for the cleansing, for self-reflection and these kind of things. So now I, I try that flavor, try to make the juice and then I will show you what it tastes like to me. The juice is ready, so it seems. I have to taste to make sure it's really ready. But first I have to um, stir a little bit to combine all the different parts of the juice evenly. And then I will taste it. So it looks nice. It's pretty runny, as um, compared to when I put mango in the beet juice. Then it is creamy, thick, more like a cream almost, a gel almost. This one is very nice, very runny, different. But let's see the flavor. That's more important. Mm. Mm. Again, again, this wonderful, amazing fruit flavor. <clears throat> I never expected beet. It has um, so little of fruit. It is so much a root, a, a vegetable. Yeah. And uh, still the, the flavor that comes out of the beet together with fruit is so much fruity, so fruitful. Another reason why that could be is in beet there are many, uh, a big part of sugar is contained in the beet. The beet is counted as the very sugary uh, fruit. 
uh, vegetable. So high in sugar, that might also add to the, um, to the fact that it can be combined so nicely with other fruit and comes out with a, such a nice flavors. Yeah, I will see. I will go, I go deeper into that, into that aspect. Um, definitely I'm highly fascinate, fascinated by the, all these flavors coming out. Very nice fruity flavor with the pineapple and the beet. You gotta try that. And it's perfect together with ginger, very sure. And yes, I prefer this definitely to, to the lemon here for now. I might try that later, but now look at this wonderful color, isn't it beautiful? Ah, and beet is highly energizing, very nice. And the more I try beet, it took me some time to do the next step. Next step will be to use the beet juice with fruit, these new flavors, in other dishes, maybe in soups or creams, dressings. I don't know yet. Um, I made some very nice fruit salads with a beet cream, yeah, beet sauce, beet glaze, yeah. Depends on what kind of fruit you add. Very, very high promising, and yeah, I'm going on, going on with that for sure. I bought some more beets than usual. I will try that now. For now, today, very happy to have this wonderful juice. It worked perfectly. I hope you enjoy it too. Maybe you will can you can relate to that beet. And if you don't like beet at all, maybe you probably wouldn't have watched the video, but in case, yeah, you should try definitely with, with fruit. It's so different the flavor you would never expect and um, yeah, you may be surprised. Okay, stay for watching and uh, maybe you would like to subscribe MD Vegan on YouTube, have another recipe every single day and you'll find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest and Twitter too. And if you want to join the Juice Fasting group, there's one it's called Tree Yoga Moon Fasting on Facebook. Uh, administration a little bit on that group. I post the juices every week. You find a lot of juices there. Some other people too who are interested in fasting sometimes. And I do it every week and it's a very, very important to me. Very um, keeps me going. Very nice every week. One new push, one new um, special day. I'm looking forward to it already. It's nothing uh, from, a, from a burden. Or, it's always delightful. So a little bit of, of getting used to it. It's such a nice habit to fast weekly. Hope you enjoyed again. See you soon.